Uh, all right. So we DJI is obviously the leader in you know third party uh, collaborations with software companies that are building onto their platform, and we can mention you know where the Mavic 3 Multispectral is com what what it's compatible with today. But I also wanted to touch on uh, specifically DJI Terra, but also this Smart Farm thing. What can you talk? What can you say about the Mavic 3 multispectral data being enhanced or or processed and used with the softwares that are available out in the market? Yes. So Pilot 2, that's one that I'm really going to tout and recommend. I mean, there really aren't any other alternatives, but Pilot 2 being able to go out and count capture the right data with your multispectral drone, it's going to have all the different mission settings, whether it's mapping, uh, whether you just need to do waypoints, or if you're doing linear for enterprise, if you're doing you know, pipeline inspections from vegetation encroachment and management, being able to do linear flights. Pilot 2 is going to be a great software to be able to plan missions. Um, Terra and Smart Farm are there to be able to process and analyze the data. So DJI Terra is going to be about the best bang for your buck for processing large multispectral data sets. It's also nice that since we process, since we manufacture the drone, we understand pretty well on how to process with photogrammetry the data sets, but you're gonna see a lot of different tools like the Pix4D uh, smart tool and Pix4D fields being able to process the data set as well. Um, and then Smart Farm, that's going to be for some light uh, analysis, which we'll get into on the use case side as well as some fleet management, and uh, you're also going to have any sort of agris management there too. So if you're looking to take data from the multispectral process through Terra and then kick it out to the agris for the application, you can run that prescription directly through Smart Farm. Okay, and and Smart Farm before had an asterisk on it that said like available in Q2 or something like that of 2023. Is that available now, or do you have a date of that release? Because not everyone, most likely, pe most people have not heard of Smart Farm before. Yeah, it's a product that we haven't done, uh, we haven't promoted very much, but see it quite a bit more this growing season. We'll probably do a specific blog post or publish something on smart farm before the growing season but it's mainly there to be the analysis piece after terra as well as just kind of maintaining your drone fleet okay perfect and and i have to take a minute to say that in the pr promotion of this webinar we did talk that dji offered up uh, a great number of uh three month licenses of terra for those that uh, participate in this webinar so if you would like to use DJI Terra, or if you would just like to provide us feedback, because we love to have that, I just put in the chat that link to a survey, monkey survey. It takes two minutes. If you fill that out, you're going to be submitting your uh, email. Through that email, you'll be sent the uh, license for DJI Terra for three months. It, it's avail It's included with your purchase for three months, but this is just for you to try it maybe with your other DJI platforms that are compatible that you can see what it can do. Um, so take advantage of that. And like I said, even if you're not 100% sure that you'll use it, ideally that's why you're doing it, but the feedback is really appreciated um, just so that we understand who you are, what you're doing, what drones you're flying. Um, that helps us know like how we, how we present information. It helps us know uh, the people that are joining these webinars. So thank you. Uh, like I said, links in the, in the, uh, chat if you can click on that still pay attention to the content but uh, if you fill that out later that'd be awesome